Hey everyone, how y'all doing today? Lumpy here. And today we are tearing into bam, 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 a Magic the Gathering Deck Builders Toolkit. Ixalan. It's supposed to have 285 cards inside, giving you an instant collection. And it contains 125 semi-randomized cards. Not really sure what that means. Semi-randomized. Anyway, four 15-card booster packs from recent Magic the Gathering sets, 100 basic land cards, a deck builder's guide to building the best Magic decks, Magic quick reference card, and a reusable card storage box. So, 125 semi-randomized cards and four 15-card booster, 15 booster packs from recent Magic the Gathering sets. They're not specifically from Ixalan, but they're from recent sets. And 100 basic lands. Anyway, let's see what she's got inside. Get the handy dandy. Bam. Credit card knife. And try to do this. It's not really sharp now. Look at that. Not really sharp. Anyway, we'll have to do something about that. All right, get that out of there. And unlike the bundles slash fat packs, there's nothing on the inside, so no sense even taking that apart. And it is a nice little box, not quite as sturdy as the fat pack boxes, and nothing fancy about it, just Magic the Gathering, the logo, and a spacer on the inside. It's a decent box, though. Let's see what our packs are. We got Kaladesh, Amonkhet, and two Ixalan. Not too bad. Maybe we got some of them new uh, error lands. Anyway, got your five colors of mana. Tells you how to build a deck. Maybe I'll go over that in some other time on a video. I don't think I'm that advanced yet to teach y'all how to build decks. I might be. I build decks and sell them to people at work, but I don't know. Anyway, we got four packs of cards here. I don't know which one is the semi-randomized 125. But we got Forsaken Sanctuary on that. Victory's Herald on the cover there on the front of that. Evolving Wilds. Now, these are probably, well, there's lands, lands, and more lands. I don't know. I'm sure the color of the band has something to do with it. We got clear, gold, white, and red. Which one is the semi-randomized? I don't know. We'll just tear open the smallest one first. Let's see. Where's the opener? There it is. Now, of course, it didn't work all the way. It worked enough, though. All right, we got Evolving Wilds. Oh, there is cards in here. Evolving Wilds, Lay Claim, and Aura. Chart of Course is a sorcery. Arborback Stomper is a beast. Merfolk Branch Walker. Raging Raptors. Shorekeeper. Pirate's Prize. There's an uncommon, there's an uncommon, there's an uncommon. Common, 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 Pirate's Prize. Uh, Tishana's Wayfinder. New Horizons. Evolving Wilds again. Duskborn Sky Marcher is an uncommon. Vicious Conquistador is an uncommon. Bishop of the Blood Stain. Call to the Feast, two of them. Bishop Soldier, common. Queen's Commission. That's a good card. Create two one one white vampires. I'm just a token freak. I love tokens. So anything that generates tokens, I like to put in my deck. Excuse me one second. All right. So. We have Sky March Blood Letter. Anointed Deacon. Two of them. Another Revolving Wilds. Lightning Rig Crew. Fiery Cannonade. R 
rigging runner kite sail free booter i think that's a buck or buck and a half or something uh dire fleet captain march of the drowned dreaded tormentor dead eye tormentor i guess that's yeah dreaded i can't read again uh headstrong brute two of them evolving wilds imperial aerosaur imperial lancer charging monstrosaur that's a good one that might be a buck a sky terror a dinosaur stampede Kinjali's Caller, two of those. Frenzied Raptor, Thrash of Raptors, two of those. Okay, so we got a bunch of commons, a bunch of uncommons. And we'll see what gold is. Yeah, this is the land pack. That's four. Eight. Twelve. All right, twelve of each color, I'm assuming. Actually, oh, there's blue up there. Yeah, there's 12 of each color. So, not bad. And the red pack. Let's see. Maybe this is our semi-randomized. <laughs> All right, Victory's Herald, a uh, rare Sphinx of Magosi, a rare. Nightmare, a very good card, rare. Shivan Dragon, rare. Garrick's Horde, rare. Imperial Aerosaur, uncommon. Advanto Vanguard, uncommon. Inspiring Cleric, Cleric, very good card, I love that card. It only costs three, you get a three, two, and you get four life when it comes on the battlefield. Um, uncommons, cast out. Uncommon. Raptor Companion. Uh, common, common, common. Ah, sorry about that, I dropped one. Um, common, Fragmentize, Compulsory Rest. Common, common, common. Angler Drake. Chart a Course. Perilous Voyage. Supreme Will. Those are all uncommons all right unsummon two of them spell pierce two of them essence scatter water trap weaver all commons doomfall gifted aetherborn a good card kite cell freebooter a good card walk the plank a good card all uncommons Dire Fleet Hoarder, two of them. Contract Killing, Supernatural Stamina. <laughs> My girlfriend wishes I had that. Supernatural Stamina. You go, boy. Duress. <laughs> yeah, I'll have Supernatural Stamina and she'll be stuck to the bed under duress. <laughs> oh, my, I amuse myself. Scarab Feast. And Commons. Charging Monstrosaur again. Very good. Glad we got two of those. Oops, I just knocked over. You know what? While I just picked that up, let me say it. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Click that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up because I am giving away the full set of Odyssey theme decks. Uh, once I get to a thousand subscribers, I will be giving these away. 
and I said I would be adding more to it as we go on and right now we have a play set of bristling well there's only two here but I will be giving a, a play set of bristling hydras away as well it's to one lucky winner you get all four decks um, or for all four of the Odyssey theme decks and a play set of bristling hydras I will be giving stuff away at 250 500 um, and a thousand as well maybe 750 haven't decided that yet but as soon as I come up with what I'll give away at 250 I'll let you all know as soon as I come up with what I'm giving away at 500 I'll let you know but please subscribe tell your friends let everybody know the quicker we uh, get them subscribers the quicker I can give this stuff away I'll ship it anywhere in the world that's all on me um, yeah, we'll figure out the rest of the details as we go on, but let's get those subscribers first. And let's continue here. Sorry about that. We got Wily Goblin. Oh, we're back to Uncommons. A Braid. Lightning Strike. A very good card for two. You get three damage to creature or player. A Nest Robber. No, oh, those are Uncommons. Fathom Fleet Firebrand. Frenzied Raptor. Pursue Glory, Shock, Shock, Savage, St oh, we're into the greens, there we go, Commons, back to Uncommon, Savage Stomp, Murfolk, Branch Walker, Arborback Stomper, Blossoming Defense, Tishana's Wayfinder, oh, that's Commons, oh, those are Uncommons, Druid of the Cow, two of them, Prey Upon, Colossal Deadmaw, Dreadmaw, Colossal Dreadmaw, Dissenter's Deliverance, and unclaimed territory and uncommon land. Pirates Cutlass. Hierophant's Chalice. Prathetic Prism. And Sun Scorched Desert. Alrighty. This is looking good. Five rares? Not bad. I don't think we're going to get any mythics. All right, what do we got in the white pack? Uh, I would say more lands. All right. We got Forsaken Sanctuary. Yeah, I think these all come in tapped. Anyway, Highland Lake. We got two of those. Another Forsaken Sanctuary. Foul Orchard. Two of those, two Stone Quarry, two Woodland Stream, two Submerged Boneyard, two Cinder Barrens, two Timber Gorge, two Tranquil Expanse, two Meandering River. And then we're back to regular lands. We have four more planes, so that makes 16. 16. Seventeen. What a strange number. Well, I'm going to guess twenty. Yep. If there's eight more of each of these. Yeah. So there's twenty of each land. And, yeah, what y'all think? You know what? I'm not even going to separate all this crap right now. I'm wasting yours time, y'all's time. Um, 20 of each basic land, not bad. And you get four booster packs to put something together. Let's go with Amonkhet first. Alright, Cartouche Zeal, Sparring Mummy, Hecma Sentinels, Master Core of the Gauntlet, Cursed Min Minotaur, Shed Weakness, Doom Dissenter, Honorary Kudu, Unwavering Initiate, Trespassers Curse and our Uncommons Censor Kefner's Monument Kefet's Monument 
Blue creature spells you cast cost one less to cast. Whenever a creature spell is cast, target creature an opponent controls doesn't untap during his controller's next untap step. For three, not bad. Grave Digger and... Oh my god, Liliana, Death's Majesty. Yeah, man, I am going Planeswalker crazy today. Holy crap. Liliana, Death's Majesty. Boo, woo, woo, woo. I'm loving it. Oh my lord. Man, I like getting Planeswalkers. Bing, 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 bing. There we have it. Anyway, for four, or for five. Three and two swamps. You get uh, Liliana, Death's Majesty, Planeswalker. For plus one, you create a 2-2 two -two black zombie creature token. Put the top two cards of your library into your graveyard. Minus three, you return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. That creature is a black zombie in addition to its other colors and types. And for seven, destroy all non-zombie creatures. Holy crap, that is excellent. Wow. All you got to do is bump that up too. Get this out, bump it up too, and you can play that minus seven. Kill everything on the board except your zombies. Wow. All right. Anybody know what that's worth? A Liliana, Death's Majesty. Wow. Very happy. Awesome. Woo! There you go, the angel and the devil. Let's go to Kaladesh. Let's see what we got in there. Man, I am ecstatic. Holy cow, I'm sure that paid for the whole uh, the whole set. I'm going to guess that's about 20 bucks. I, I, I don't really know until I look it up, but please let me know down in the comments. If you all know what it's worth, man. All right, anyway, Kaladesh. All right, Terror at the Fairgrounds, Thriving Ibex. Thriving Turtle. Look at them. Uh, thriving Grubs. Everything's thriving. Thriving Ibex Turtle and Grubs. A Lawless Broker. Thriving and Lawless. A Kujar Seed Sculptor. Tezzeret's Ambition. Dund Operative. Narna Cobra. Narna Cobra. <laughs> that sounds like someone's last name. I'm Richard. Richard Narna Cobra. Uh -uh. Propeller Pioneer and Arborback Stomper for our first uncommon. Harsh Scrutiny. Target opponent reveals his or her hand. You choose a creature card from it. That player discards that card. Then you scry one. Uh, Aether Meltdown. Man, you don't want your Aether to melt down. Anyway, for two, you got Flash and uh, Enchant Creature or Vehicle. When Aether Meltdown enters the battlefield, you get two energy counters. Enchanted Permanent gets minus four, minus zero. Wow. Cool artwork, too. Anyway. Oh, guess what? A Bristling Hydra. Man, we don't have enough of those. A 4-3 for four. When Bristling Hydra enters the battlefield, you get three energy counters. Pay three, put a 1-1 counter on Bristling Hydra, and it gains Hexproof until end of turn. A Planes and a Construct token. So, nothing for nothing. We're going to put that in a sleeve right along with all the foils. Why not? You know? We got our foils, we got our regular Hydra. Well, non-foil bristling Hydra. Pretty cool. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. My cat just woke up. She's going to be meowing at me in a second. Excuse me, I'm getting a drink here. All right, Ixalan. Mm -hmm. 
we got any of them double-sided lands, we got to check and see if they're uh, got the blue glue or the clear glue. Slash of Talons, Mark of the Vampire, Sure Strike, Queen's Commission, Pirate's Prize, Spike Tail Ceratops, Hijack, Contract Killing, Blinding Fog, Paladin of the Bloodstained, and there it is, Emergent Growth. Target creature gets plus five, plus five until end of turn and must be blocked this turn if able. For four. Ha, <laughs> yeah, man. Sheltering Light. For one, you got an instant. Target creature gains indestructible until end of turn and scry one. Dark Nourishment. For five, Dark Nourishment deals three damage to target creature or player. You gain three life. And our rare is Shadowed Caravel, a vehicle. Whenever a creature you control explores, put a 1-1 counter on Shadowed Caravel. It has crew 2. Tap any number of creatures you control with a total power of 2 or more. This vehicle becomes an artifact creature until end of turn. It's a 2-2 two -two for 2. That is our rare. And we have a... Wow, that feels really thick. A mountain and a pirate. Aye, matey. We've got the pirates. So, we'll slap that in the sleeve right away. And we shall get to the last pack of the day. All right, can we pull out another Planeswalker? Something good. Let's see what it brings us. Give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, share, tell your friends. I will be giving away lots of stuff on this channel. Slash Italian... Italians. Slash Italians, Mark of the Vampire, Sure Strike, Queen's Commission. Doesn't it look a lot like the last pack? Shorekeeper, except for that one. Ravenous Dagger Tooth, Depths of Desire. Ooh, man, if you knew the depth of my desire for you, baby. Uh, commune with Dinosaurs, Hijack. Gain control of target artifact or creature until end of turn. Untap and it gains haste until end of turn. So you hijack your buddy's uh, creature and you whack him with it. A water trap weaver and belligerent brontodon. He's a belligerent bastard, isn't he? For seven, you get a four six. Each creature you control assigns combat damage equal to its toughness rather than its power. <laughs> That's why he's belligerent. He's backwards. Pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. Lightning rig crew. For three, you got a zero five. I don't. Oh, it's a goblin pirate. Lightning Rig Crew deals one damage to each opponent when you tap it. Whenever you cast Pirate Spell, untap Lightning Rig Crew. Bright Reprisal. Destroy target attacking creature and draw a card for five. And our uh, rare is... Sanctum Seeker, a vampire knight. Check out that artwork, man. He is styling. Anyway, Vampire Knight. When a vampire you control attacks, each opponent loses one life and you gain one life. For four. Two and two swamps, you get a three, four. That is our rare. And we have a swamp and treasure. Sacrifice this artifact. Add one man of any color to your mana pool. So, he goes in a sleeve. Not quite a planeswalker. But I really do think we have the makings of some pretty decent decks here. If we were to use only these cards, I think you can build a decent deck out of this. If you went and spent, what, $24, $23 on this, um, yeah, we got some decent rares, plenty of lands, and we got a Planeswalker, man. Didn't expect that. 
but y'all need to go out, try anything once, twice if you like it. Hey, you might want to go out and try buying a, a deck builder's tool kit. Try it once, twice if you like it. Y'all have a great day. Lumpy, out.